Hello, this is Azrael Ratz, CEO of Ratz Pack Media. Today, I want to talk about how I got started in marketing. If you watched my very first video, which I'm going to post over here, we've come a very long way since that very first video. I spoke about that I came from a math background. I learned everything that I know about marketing from testing and reviewing the data. So the question is, how, what is the best way to review the data that you have to learn how to market better to your customers? To me, the two best services for analytical data for your website are Google Analytics and ClickMeter. If you want to track analytics on Facebook, Facebook has an analytics tool. There are also plenty of analytics tools that connect to Facebook, which we're not going to get into now. But once people have come to your website, these two tools are amazing for tracking what people are doing on your website, learning about what people want from your website, and figuring out who the people are that are coming to your website with intent to buy and actually purchasing or registering on your website. So first, let's talk about Google Analytics. To set up Google Analytics, if you have a, oh, if you have a, a WordPress website, simply install the Yoast Google Analytics plugin. I'm going to put a link down below on YouTube or above on Facebook. You just install the plugin. You create an account on Google Analytics. It takes under a minute. And you just sync the two accounts very, very easily. And they are now connected. It's totally free. And now Google can track every person that comes into your website, where they're coming from, what pages they're looking at, how they're flowing through your website, and you can set up goals and conversions to track if people are fin fulfilling a goal, whether that be getting to your thank you page for a, an event or signing up for an email list or buying your product. You could set up goals to allow you to see there are 100 people coming from Facebook. There are 30 people coming from Instagram. There are 10 people coming from Pinterest, so on and so on. And Google can show you all these things. What I really like about ClickMeter is that it shows you the, it finishes off the picture of analytics. It, it allows you to put a link specifically, let's say I want, to put, I want to create a link, put it right on a Facebook ad. Now I know this Facebook ad has this, con, this specific URL. Now a person sees this Facebook ad, clicks on the link, and then goes on to purchase, ClickMeter will track that purchase from the URL. So while Google is only tracking the success, ClickMeter is tracking from the initial click to the success. What that allows you to do when you compare both of those two tools together, it gives you the total package. It tells you where the people are coming from in Google Analytics. And then it tells you what they're doing on your website. And then it tells you who's converting on your website. What they're, you can even set up what they're searching for on your website. And then on, with ClickMeter, you can now see how are those people that are coming from Facebook or Instagram or Pinterest or, or Google Plus, how are they eventually actually purchasing? So I'm going to put, again, I'm going to put a link for both of these things down below on YouTube and above on Facebook. If you're using these tools or any other analytics tools for your website, I would love to hear about them. Please put them down in the comments. Don't forget to share this, share this video, like this video, or over here if, if, it's, if you're watching this big. And please, Please write in the comments if you have any other business questions. I would love to answer them. And thank you so much for watching and have a great day.